Hello, welcome back. Last time I learned about version control, and there is only one puzzle left in this world, unless this leads to some bonuses. Let's go sneak. How about... I'm a lizard. Okay, good for sneaking. Low to the ground. Lizard is you. Fences stop. Flag is win. Box is flag. Box is shut. Box is there. Lamp on lizard is fence. Okay. Got it. Key is open. Fruit is hot. I don't see one. But I could make one. Grass is melt. Grass is defeat. Key is weak. Pumpkin is push. And there's a revert. Ugh. Key doesn't have to be weak. Melt and defeat. Okay, so I need fruit to melt that grass so that it doesn't kill me. I guess I make too much noise sneaking through the grass or something. What am I trying to do overall? Box has flag, flag is win, box is shut. Bring something that's open to box. What's open? Key. What's key? Nothing. Okay, so it seems like I could do this if I wanted. Uh-huh. And could do this if I wanted. All right, now the fruit... needs to melt the thing. Okay, I see. There's a fruit word over there. I need to spell pumpkin is fruit and leave it there. And fruit is key and leave it there. And... No. Uh... Wait, hang on. Okay, so I need... Duh. Uh... Ultimately, I need a key over there. First, I need a fruit. So if I spell pumpkin and key and leave it... And then key is fruit and leave it... Key is fruit and push. No, that makes key is push. I need... Fruit is revert. At some point, somehow. Wait, no. Key is fruit. Pumpkin is key. Key no longer is fruit. Fruit is push. Fruit is revert. Key and fruit is push. Fruit is revert. Here we go. Uh, no. No. Maybe. No. Whoa. What happened to that pumpkin? <laughs> Key is weak. It was a key and it was on the thing. Okay, if I don't do any of that... Fruit comes through here and I don't have any words to spell... Wait, but yeah, I just have a fruit. What? Key doesn't have to be weak. So what? What? So overall, what I'm trying to do... 
I can only take one thing through here as far as I can tell, and that's gonna have to be my pumpkin key fruit. I need a fruit for this section, I need a key for this section. I can't take any text with me. Wait, so that means unless... Maybe I can set up a stable cycle here. Yes, okay, sure. I've been taught about this. Pumpkin is key and fruit. Pumpkin is revert. Or is that pumpkin is key is fruit? Because if pumpkin is key and fruit... Oh, I can make more. I can make more. That might help. Uh, key is revert. Key is weak. Fruit is revert. Okay, and when key stops being... weak... then I'll get... Uh, keys being left behind. This is not very stealthy. If this is supposed to be a sneaking mission. How am I going to turn this into a key? By doing... Let's see, I better uh, do this now. By doing this. There we go. Okay, that was very strange. I kind of understood what I did. Kind of. It worked out, and I guess that's what matters. <laughs> All right, area complete. Nice. Uh, that was the start puzzle button. I don't have to press accept to accept area complete. It just does it. Okay, great. All right, all shiny. Why is this one not shiny? What's stopping it? These two? Has it been long enough? Let's say it has. Deep doors. I'm ready to look at you again. Maybe with today's perspective I'll understand what this takes. So, deep doors. Doors sink. Like this. Whoosh. And ice is terrible. It turns all text into rock. So, um... I can push this to the side. I can push it to the other side. I can push it all the way to the side and get a word through here. In fact, I can get a few of them. I can make like tile mimic bird is push. Okay, cool. Here's a tile I can push around. That is needs to go there to where the flag is. But the fundamental problem remains here, which is that I, uh... that the text turns into, uh... rocks when I get it near ice. So what fixes that fundamental problem? If I must get an is in here... Then this needs to be disrupted. That's right. So this nonsense. Okay. Now there was something I was able to do with text near... Ice is... Something else. Or... No, that's just how it is. Text near... So, right. This text must be disrupted. Like, this rule absolutely, irrevocably forbids solving the puzzle. So I absolutely must disrupt this text. This is, this is my entire goal. And also have enough resources to get in there, past the deep doors. So, like, yeah. If the first thing I could do would be to somehow kill any word in this sentence then I could probably do the rest just fine. So what are the ways that sentence could be disrupted? 
Ice is ice. Wall and ice is stop. Ghost is you. Door is sink. I can't mimic door. Bird is push. All right, properties that I could get access to with mimic. Push, which text always is. Ice. Text near ice is ice. Text near ice is rock. Ice is ice. Text mimic, but text can't mimic ice. So I can spell down from here, or I can put the word tile on top of another thing, or I can put the word bird on top of another thing, as we've seen before. One of those was going to help me somehow. Tile near ice bird is rock. That just makes tile near ice is rock, tile near bird is rock. Or sorry, text near bird is rock. That's kind of good, but that uses up my bird, so the text can't be near a bird because none exists, unless I make tile is bird. Okay, so if I made tile is bird, bird is text, the bird was in there, then I'd have a tile and I'd have to make tile is bird. Push. Okay, I'm starting to see how this might be plausible. Okay. This uses up a lot of resources. I don't know if I'll have anything left over, but first let's just try and disrupt this rule. Okay, so like, this is very similar to how I was trying to do stuff before. The only thing this bird does is it overlaps with the text and becomes text itself. I think that's the position where I do that? Seems reasonably likely. Uh, okay, so bird unbecomes push. I put this in the corner. Now this is going over stuff I already thought I understood, so then I need to put... Okay, so before I think too much farther ahead, if I bird is text, that's cool, but I don't have a bird. If I tile as bird is text, and the tile was already in a good place, then tile could delete this word, right? So I think I want to put this over here. Uh, that is, can wait, maybe I hope. Now, what about push, though? Don't I have a problem with maybe the bird goes over here and I move everything to the right and let's try that. So yeah, one advantage of that is I can just put you and push you like that. Okay, that's interesting. So you would go here. No, I have to prefix this. Okay, where would the bird go? Well, let's worry about that when it's time to form this. So, not there, obviously, but, um... Oh. I do have to spell... Bird is text. No, this looks much worse. However... Yeah, obviously I can't put it in that corner, but first, let's just at least see, um... If I bring that tile over, and then I say tile is push, and then I put you... Oh wait, that bird's just going to turn into text. Well, not anymore, but you know, <laughs> if it did. Uh, 
I'd put the tile somewhere. I don't know exactly where. Let's just say here for now. Uh, then bird is text, then tile is bird. Not bad. I just don't have bird as text. Okay, but this all has to be over here. So how do I push the tile? Tile mimic text would do it. Now, okay, so all of that is using the bird to go behind the text. And then... Ooh, what about... Rock is bird. After I turn some text into rock. That might be very good. Does use up a piece of text though. Okay, so how, many, how much text is required for what I'm doing and how much do I have left over? I might also just be able to manufacture, like, a bunch of stuff. Like, say if I'd overlap this with rock, then I'd get... Ooh, text near ice is rock and also bird. Then I could bird as text. And I could have multiple birds doing things. Ooh. Oh, I like this. Oh, this is interesting. Let's try that. Um, let's say I would just do it in the corner like this. Uh, I'm gonna... Ooh, I'd like some more words over here, but I don't get any. Um, that's fine. I'll just put this over here and form that from the other side. Now, I, I don't have anything spelling... Well, okay, I'll use this is, maybe. Uh, rock bird is push. Do I need that, though? No. No, I don't. I think. Let's try without and see how far I get. So yeah, this is a whole new thing to try, which is good. I needed a whole new thing to try because, like, I was getting nowhere before. Um, let's say maybe I'm done with push. And I open this door. Okay. Um, okay. There we go. I have the bird word. Bird is text. Text near ice is bird. Text near ice is rock. So now when I put a text near ice, I get both. And then bird is text. So I get bird text again. Ooh. And there's another bird. Now, that's cool, but it doesn't help me. Okay. So I did it. But I still have to kill this text, and I've done nothing toward that. Okay. Um... Okay. So I still have to kill that text. Uh... And the way to kill the text is to put bird or tile, whichever word I put in there, near it. So let's try with tile. Why couldn't I do tile? Because I can't make tile push very easily. That's like real hard to do. Um, yeah, it's much easier for bird to be push. I can get bird in here and push it around and 
make it unpush, therefore I can still get through having moved the bird. But so what? If I spell tile mimic text, I get to push the tile, but then I have tile mimic text here, and I can't spell bird as text, or tile is text. Tile cannot mimic text. Neither can bird, of course. So there is no text mimicking happening if I want this to still do its thing. Okay. So... Now, why do I get stuck if I just try to form this over here? I don't think I currently know. So if I just put you... was it here? Let's say it's there. You go in the corner. So I need to form... Tile is bird is text. And maybe ice bird is push. Ah, I don't have enough fizzes. Okay, well that's likely to be a problem. Tile mimic bird. Tile mimic bird is text. Okay, let's put that is back by push. Because that'll also make tile into text. Do I want that? I'm not sure. Tile mimic bird is text near ice bird is rock. Is push also. <laughs> No, that's not what I wanted. I wanted tile is bird. Because... Uh... Yeah, okay. So that's where I fall down. So I'm not using the mimic. I'm not moving the tile. And I, I don't have an is there. Oh. Right, of course. Uh, I spelled tile as bird too early, for one thing. If I didn't spell that quite so early, uh, different things, I think, would happen. So if I do this first... I get a bird for one turn, then it turns into a word. So if in that one turn, that tile could be next to the crucial word in here. So I'm not using mimic and push. I do want to use push. Text can't come through here. I can, maybe. Uh... Okay, I guess there's a question of precedence. If I form both tile is bird and bird is text on the same turn, I can't do that. Okay, um... This is the mimic puzzle set, so the mimic word is probably involved. Can I get another bird? Kinda, but kinda not. How about... 
Well, I'd have to do this, and that's no good. Wait, am I sure I don't want bird as tile? Wouldn't that be kind of good? If bird was tile... Okay, there's a tile there now. Uh... I can spell tile as text. Do I need tile as push right now? Okay, so text near ice tile is rock. That tile still is not push. Neither is bird. Bird is tile. Yeah, I can make tile as bird. His text is push mimic here. Now I have birds both sides, but now tile is up there, and... Is that bad? Am I sure that's bad? Yeah, because I gotta use my is there, and I need it down here. Also, bird's not push right now, and I can't make it. Yep, now it's just text. Nothing happens. Nope. It really feels like it's an arrangement of this. Okay, so, what specific problem am I having? I have no idea, that's the problem. <laughs> okay, so the problem is I have no idea. That's a bad problem to have. Can I turn it into a better one? I'm not able to get something both underneath this ice and the non-word representation of it nearby in order to actually turn text into a something. I definitely can't ever make rock as text. I can only make bird as text or tile as text. One of those two turns into text and goes under this. Whichever one does it clogs up my passage there for one thing. This push can't make it through that, that passage, so either push is on the right and is vertically free, or it's on the left and is up in this row just jamming up everything and making this impossible to think about. What am I supposed to do with this mimic? This has never been useful in any way. Tile mimic bird is text near ice is rock. Bird is push... but then I'd still want to make tile as bird to actually make this go off and delete any of this text. This is impossible. But it must somehow not be. But it seems like it is. It's just like five gajillion things I can do. And somewhere in that haystack is the one needle of, like, the thing that'll actually be useful somehow that 
Doesn't really look like it's going to be useful. I just have to find it first. And then once it's in my hand, I can identify it as a needle. What? Okay, I have to do things to make any insights, so... Um, putting this bird under the... Did I ever manage to make text near tile ice's rock? I don't think I did, because tile is hard to make push. Without putting something to the left of this. In fact, it's impossible. Okay, so now this is useful. Tile can't ever be push. I mean, that's not true, but... Uh, wait a second. Now... Maybe I do have a two-step thing where I... I put this bird under here and... Ooh, text near ice bird is rock bird. If I spelled that... I keep on getting more and more birds, and also bird is text. Bird is text, near ice bird is rock bird. That's a lot of bird words. So that costs one arbitrary bit of text each time I want to do that transformation. But bird is text will be permanently sp Spelled, so I'm never going to get that text actually under two places. Unless this tile is bird. Hmm. Each of these pieces of text has its own facing. <laughs> Uh, okay, is this puzzle still impossible? Am I done attempting it for today? Yeah, alright, sure. I think that's reasonable. I got a little closer, maybe, but it's still absolutely ridiculous. This one was just too daunting to, like, really even try and parse, right? Yeah, I never made a big effort here, so next time I'll probably, like, actually try that. Because... There was just a lot of stuff going on, and I ran away in terror. Um, this one I've actually hammered against, and, you know, made a couple little chips in the stone, but, like, I haven't found the... the main fault that'll make it all fall apart. This puzzle is ridiculous, but, you know, I expected there to be a few of those in here, at least, and just, just this, this World 19, that's one of them. All right, so 23 next time, I should make a proper attempt at this. Uh, so I think that's the plan. I'll see you then.